There are times when you might want to attach a large number of files to an email. So you put them all in a folder and you want to attach that folder to that email. Well, attaching one or two files is easy, but you cannot attach a folder as is to an email. To do that, you have to convert the folder to a zipped file. And to do that, you right click on the folder in Internet Explorer, you click Send To, and then you choose Compressed. Let me demonstrate. Let me demonstrate. In uh, my computer, if I go to Internet Explorer, and look in my documents often used, one of the items in there is SCG stuff. That's Seniors Computer Group, things that I have saved. And one of the things inside that folder is Board Agenda. And in Board Agenda, there are all sorts of files files uh, for lots of different years and lots of different board meetings, et cetera, et cetera. <clears throat> Supposing I wanted to send that board agenda folder to somebody, maybe our president. So I go over to my email program, and I set up to compose a new email, and I go to attach. And when I get to attach, I go to uh, documents often used, and then I go down to SCG stuff, and then I go to board agenda and I try to click on board agenda. When I do, it just opens up all the things that are inside that folder and I can choose one of them, but I can't choose all of them all at once. So what do I do? Well, I go back to Internet Explorer. I go to board agenda. I right click on it and I go down to send to, and I find compressed zipped folder, and I left click on that. And all of a sudden there is a new file, not a new folder, there is a new file called boardagenda.zip. And I can go to my outgoing email now and come to my documents often used and my SCG stuff. And in my SCG stuff, there is a boardagenda.zip. And when I click that, it is now attached to this email that I haven't constructed yet. That is just how you do it. I hope it helps.